on average you're looking at probably eight to ten thousand people that are actually spearing they they put about six thousand shanties out probably in our whole family in our group we probably got 50 shanties we're covering a lot of water right now but you almost have to to try and find some decent water He's out there checking, I think, right now. Um, we're gonna cut a sturgeon hole in for that shanty and check the water oh, that way. Seen yeah, he said he could see bottom. Roger, we'll cut you in here. What we did is I drilled a hole in the ice again. We're checking for water clarity yeah. and depth. Right now we're 13 feet of water. I can see the teeth. I can initialize the teeth on here at about 12 feet, so I can almost see it right on bottom, which is good. If I can see saw teeth on the bottom, you're gonna see a fish. Um, sturgeon spearing is a tradition out here. Um, involves a prehistoric fish. A uh, lot of chasing around, checking for clear water. Yeah, I mean, it's it's something we grew up with as kids. Until I get emotional about it. My grandpa's one of the originals that kind of started spearing out here. It's, it's like one of the last things my grandpa left to us, you know. Other families, they have money and inherited to them, land. We had sturgeon spirit. Well, that's, you know, that's, that's why we do it.